Oh, good morning, Internet. So, um, basically, I kept my car, I kept my truck, and um, I haven't decided yet whether or not to keep my house. Um, I'm on the deed to the house, but not the mortgage, so if I left, it would it shouldn't reflect too poorly on my credit or whatever not that I need credit um, I could probably just go buy another house somewhere else but then it would take moving and moving is not really fun um, there's somewhere around forty thousand dollars in equity in this house so if I stayed here one I get a house cheaper um, I get a house cheaper than, than basically uh, the surrounding houses. Everyone else is paying 122,000. This house would be like 78. So I'd gain like 50,000 dollars in equity. So that means if I stayed here, <coughs> I could spend 30 grand to fix up the house. Uh, to sell it for 155 or, or 122 or whatever you know like I could spend 20 grand fixing it up you know and surely a new floor and maybe a new sink and some electrical would be less than uh, 40 grand you get the idea though but that's where I'm at um, I still haven't been put on the mortgage or uh, paid a house payment. House payments due tomorrow, I think. So I have to decide whether I'm going to go into foreclosure or deed in lieu and transfer the deed back to the bank, or just keep it. My mom said I should keep it and um, pay it off and fucking live in it. But I think it's um, truthfully more expensive. I mean, sort of. Uh, Okay, if I get over the first initial payment of whatever, you know, 78, uh, then, um, I'm sorry, I'm not awake yet, I need more coffee, and I'm kind of sick today, my hair is growing out, I look like Raggedy Ann, <laughs> okay, um, so, can pay it off, um, fix it up and sell it. Uh, it'd be a pain in the butt, but it would give me time to sell off all this crap, you know, because there's a lot of stuff here, dude. Um, oh, it's not worth very much, though. You know what I mean? Like, it's like, okay, it's a dresser, it's a this, it's a that. It's just not, you know, it's more um, emotional value than actual value more just dusty things that should just go Ugh. I don't know um, me I'd like to live in an apartment like all bills paid you know, uh, you know 700 months all bills paid don't have to worry about it you know? but then again you have neighbors and you have this and you have that you know? I don't know where I want to be, what I want to do. I think I ought to just stay here, but God, it's going to suck. Like, there's so much to do here. But it's my life, you know? And it would be like walking away from everything I've known for so long. I suppose I could readjust out in the world, but I'm not really a world person. I'm more of a stay in here and live my life type of person yay uh, a lot of people bitch on the internet it's supposed to be fun I need like a oh, I need, oh my freaking bed broke this is my bed by the way I usually sleep in it and it's like comfortable and I like it I can buy another one if I could find one I have another one. And you know, you know the sad part is I have all this crap and I'm so emotionally attached to it, it's hard for me to like throw it away. It's like, oh, that chair could be useful. 
you know, I turn into my mother, a person who hoards everything. My God, I don't want to be that. Oh, whatever.